Northern Arizona is home to many talented writers and performers, and one has shared her experiences throughout the world in acting. Giselle Suarez will be performing her play, Death Monologues, on March 8th at 4 p.m. at the Doris Harper White Community Playhouse. This performance is Suarez's portrayal of mortality composed into five short story soliloquies. A native to Cottonwood, Suarez wrote this play with inspiration from her ex experience at home losing her mother. Tickets are $7 for students and seniors and $10 general admission. And Izzy Today's Nick Ponicello caught up with Suarez to take a look behind the curtain and learn more about the story writing process. After she died, I mean, there was a big hole in my life, but there was this force almost guiding me to write this. And I call it like death was courting me. We need to have this conversation. We need to bring, bring death back to life because it allows us to live fuller and truer. I know you better than you know yourselves and I love you. I've had a hard time getting this show out there on one hand because the material is people aren't ready for it. It's a unique and uplifting experience. There are some emotional things in there, of course. I mean, you're dealing with death. <laughs> it's always emotional, but I could still feel my father's love shooting through me and at the same time I was filled with a sickening grief. Everybody that's seen it for the most part, at least the feedback I get, not one person is sorry, like, oh my God, that was the most depressing thing I wish I hadn't gone. I mean, some of the most memorable moments are people who have come to me with tears in their eyes and it almost like, it humbles me so, so much and there's a big release for them. I love to dance. Knock, knock. Look at me. I'm right here. Mortality. She's the one character that I believe is a part of all of us, even me, who has this relationship with death, where it's like, you know what? This is BS. It is unfair. It is cruel. It is some cosmic joke that we can never escape until we're dead, you know? So death has to come in after her and say, hey, guys, sorry, but I'm here, you know, like, and there's nothing you can do about it, you know, so, you know, we're all going to die, so why not check it out, you know, what do you got to lose? <laughs> <So>. <laughs>